Hello, welcome back to Life No Life. Kevin and I are on the go. So, this is the situation. Two of my favorite hobbies, making videos and crafting. What better way to honor our sweet little Xavier? Doing the things I love. So, as much as we're still grieving, um, yeah, I'm going to get back at it because that's my happy place. So, I have a story to tell you. So, yesterday, Kevin and I went out first um, to a movie and dinner, and the movie was amazing, Mary Poppins. And when we got out of the movies, we didn't know where we were going for supper. And I said, why don't we go to Denny's? So we did. And we sat down next to this table where there was like five adults. And my first thought was, man, do we have to listen to everything they're saying? Because they were talking so loud. And then what they were talking about the one man was talking about his mission trips and what churches that he's been um, speaking at and this and that. So I was like, oh, this is why we're supposed to be sitting here. So we got talking to them and we explained what has been going on with Xavier. And the husband had gone out to the car and the wife was sitting there talking to us. And he came back with um, a CD of him and his wife's music and a magazine with his email and stuff like that. And then they said, and we want you to start a new year blessed, so we're going to pay for your meal. Well, Kevin and I just kind of looked at each other and didn't even know what to say. So anyways, that's what we're going to do. We, that was a big cat that I just saw. Squirrel! <laughs> Anyways, it looked like a jackrabbit and it was a, it was a cat. So, today's a new day. We are out on the hunt to find me some shoes. I'm getting back at crafting, so the, um, the craft that I'm going to be working on this month is for Valentine's Day, so we're going out looking for some supplies for that. And moving on. So, we will chat with you a little bit later in the day. Bye-bye. Hello. So, we went to lunch. Then we went to Michael's. Yes, I got more craft supplies. <laughs> <laughs> and it's snowing because our cold front left us and now it's it's in Ontario North Bay <laughs> yeah <laughs> it's in our it's back home where the kids are living now so they're freezing their butts and we're comfy <laughs> so um I just thought of something and if you would like to Kevin and I could do a Q&A with you guys. So, down in the comments, put your questions. And once we have, you know, a decent amount of questions that we can make a decent size video, um, we'll sit down and do a Q&A with you. I thought that would be kind of fun. I saw Michelle and Bruce at Chickens by the Lake doing it, and I thought it'd be fun. So, anyway. We are going to go to Costco. I don't know what for. Just we got all the time in the world, so why not just enjoy it, right? So, yeah, I'll have a haul for you later. See you later. So we just finished in Costco. It's crazy in there. But I had a very nice phone call while I was shopping. Lisa. Shoot, I should have went out the other way. Oh, shoot. <laughs> um, Lisa, the Catholic unschooler from the United States, 
phoned me and that was very nice thank you so much it means the world to me with all the support that everybody's been giving us so yeah that was that was awesome and we'll catch up again later so anyways we now need to try and get out of this mess <laughs> yeah there's traffic from every which way but I got quite a good haul for you to see later <laughs> see you in a bit hello all right so it is I don't even know what time it is 20 after 6 Kevin and I left the house at noon <laughs> we just got back and uh, I'm so excited to tell you guys that we rented a P.O. box so in the description down below I'll put my P.O. box because I'd love to get letters from you guys and I'd love to make homemade cards and send back to you so yeah I'm pretty excited about that so uh, anyway in a few minutes I'll bring you back and I'll show you all the goodies that we bought today and, uh, be sh and I'll be sure to include my P.O. box all right, we're back with our haul. We went to Michael's, Costco, Canadian Tire, Dollar Tree, and Payless Shoes. Right? Yeah. Okay. So, Michael's had their paper containers. Buy two, get one free. So, of course, you know I had to get three. Then, we had a coupon for 55% off one item. So, I chose this washi tape and then they had their um, recollections paper pads buy one get one free so you know I had to get four I got four all different ones pretty papers because I have a Valentine's project coming up for my um, Canadian swapping group paper crafting swapping group so there's that one there's That one and all kinds of fun stuff. All right, then do you want to move those, Kevin, out of the way? And then we'll do Costco. So um, I'm always amazed at how cheap everybody in the states pays for their eggs. That doesn't happen here in Canada. This is 30 eggs, and how much were they? Seven twenty-nine. Yeah. Now, we paid probably a little bit more if we went to the grocery store because some of our stores, a dozen eggs is two eighty nine, Yeah. To $3. So, I mean, still, it's for us, it's still comparable. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Computer paper. You got computer paper. Yeah. How much was it? Uh, I'm just trying to look. Nine forty nine. For how many sheets? 800 sheets. 800 sheets for... So it's almost two packs, like 500. Yeah. yeah. All right. Pasta. What did we get for pasta? We got... Seven cheese. Seven cheese stuffed. Tortellini. Yeah. Uh, and that those three packages, they'll do Kevin and I like, oh, six or seven meals at least. So we'll repackage them in portion sizes. Somebody doesn't have the glasses on. No, you're right. And it's not spot. It's just trying to look for it. <laughs> just trying to look for it, too. Well, these are my uncool glasses. <laughs> he likes his Oakleys. Oh, right here. Rainbow towards the $15.99. Yeah, and like that'll do us at least six meals, probably more. Yeah. Yeah. All right, then we got the finished uh, tablets, 100 tablets. Yeah, so they were Quantamax, normal, and this is probably where you guys in the States are going to hit the floor for what we pay for stuff <laughs> up here. Uh, they're regular $22.89, and they're $8 off. Wow. So it was uh, $14.99, which is really good, because the Costco brand, Kirkland brand, is $12.99. Okay. Yeah. Can't see it because of the pasta. Oh, okay. yeah. Kevin's gagging over this, but 
<laughs> you sounded like John, Cherish's husband. In her video, she always goes, Ugh. he always goes, Ugh. she's like, John. So, kettle clam. Uh, clam chowder. Clam chowder. Now, I don't. There's eight in it. Yeah, is it eight? Oh, it's tin. It's, it's cans. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, eleven ninety nine. Yeah. And our favorite laundry soap. Yeah. Gain. Although we didn't need it, and we didn't need these either, but because of the price. Yeah. Because it's, it's such a good deal. Uh, the gain normally, and this is almost six. Uh, six liters, five point one nine liters, which is one point five six U.S. gallons. Uh, regular nineteen ninety nine, four dollars off, so we got it for fifteen cool. ninety nine. And even the smaller ones that we get at Walmart that are four point eight liters, we pay upwards to thirteen, twelve, fifteen dollars. Yeah. Yeah. And then, oh, my conditioner. So, how much was my conditioner? Conditioner was eight eighty nine. Yeah, and that's one point. Which is still a good deal. Because oh yeah. In the stores, they want upwards to twelve dollars for yeah. that bottle. Yeah, and then the well, see, normally we don't get the liquid; we get the the normal the cap extra strength, caplets but or whatever. They didn't have any for some reason. Uh, these ones here are eight ninety nine for one hundred and twenty. Which is, yeah, which is to fourteen dollars cheap than buying the same Advil ones. Oh, well. and it's ibuprofen. Ibuprofen is ibuprofen. Exactly. Unfortunately, you can't tell everybody that. <laughs> Your Kirkland AA batteries. Uh, they were twelve forty nine for forty eight. For yeah, for forty eight pack, which is ideally it's about a dollar per four per four batteries, which is better than the dollar store and they're better quality. Yeah, because our dollar store, like Dollar Tree, is a dollar twenty five in Canada, so. And then that's from Costco too. Yeah, the Scotch Brite uh, cleaning pad. So I have enough here probably to last just like two years. <laughs> yep. Uh, it's just I normally buy these at the dollar store uh, for a dollar a piece in around there or something like that. But dollar twenty-five. Yeah, or no, the dollar store. Oh, dollar rama. Yeah, dollar rama. Uh, so it actually worked out. It's a twenty-one pack, and they're only. Oh, fifteen ninety nine. Yeah. So they're actually cheaper than the dollar store. Yep. If you work it out, yes, you put out a little bit more money now, but in the, in the long run, in the long run, you save. Two more things here from yeah. Costco. Uh, dual fruit salads. You get twenty. Uh, I just have to find it here. Uh, ten ninety nine. So that's a so good. It, yeah. I. I can't remember what they go for in the store, like two ninety nine, three ninety nine. Something like for that. A six pack? I think so. Something like that. So Yeah. Yeah. And then we always get the Kirkland brand. Uh, well we have a new we're starting to buy it again. because uh, uh, I don't know if they reduce the amount. I don't think so. One point one five. Uh, and it's only eleven ninety nine. Yeah. For medium cheddar. And we'll pay almost uh eight ninety nine just for 700 grams. Mm -hmm. So that's a good deal for the cheese. Kirkland. Yeah. And it tastes good. Yeah. Yeah. It's like cheap. I don't know. Cheese is cheese for most of it. Some people get picky with the type, but. I don't well, know. I like the different cheeses than you do, though. Yeah. I like, like, I like the Goudas and I stuff. Like yeah. Mozzarella. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Then. On to Canadian Tire. I have no idea what this deal cost because I sat in the car while he went and did this. He said that he needed a new drill. I did because my current one that I have, I can't get batteries anymore for them. I tried, I looked, and it's just because the drill's old, I, the drill's got to be 10, 10 or so. Old. So the batteries don't hold the charge. They'll hold long enough for me to do a quick job, and that's it. But it's kind of getting... Uh, Frustrating. frustrating to use it so I always keep an eye out for drills that are on like tools that are on sale I never ever pay full price for any tools that I own well we don't have to because Canadian Tire yeah, is they always, like they have crazy sales yeah. so I had looked at another brand and I know you got in the states the DeWalt brand but there it was 229 I just I didn't want to put that kind of money out for it 
So the Mastercraft, this one was 42% off, uh, worked out to 150 before taxes, I think 172 after tax. And it's a combo kit. So I get an impact drill and a normal, uh, normal cordless drill with it. The nice thing about this is the impact drill is really great to use when you're working with wood and screws and stuff like that for the impact. Cool. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Then we come to my cheapy bu uh, yeah. buys. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, they were regular $50. And I think with tax, with these two items here, they were two, that was $2. These ended up with tax $47.97, yeah. I believe. Well, and pay less. Everything in the store was buy two things, get one free. So I bought the shoes and they had these little notebooks. So I bought a notebook. So then I got Dorothy a free notebook. <laughs> so and now I got thinking about that. We got ripped off. We should have got another pair of shoes. For who? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just, they didn't have anything I liked there anyway. So I'm particular with my shoes. <laughs> so I either wear Reebok, Asics, or New Balance, or yeah, Asics. Or New Balance. So, mm -hmm. unfortunately, the running shoes they have there, I don't like. Yeah. Neither the boots. It, I have to admit, with Payless, it's great when you're on a really, really strict budget, but quality isn't necessarily there. I would sooner put out a little bit more money for the quality and have something that will last. And I just needed a cheap little pair of boots for, yeah. for, for to wear with my dress pants. Okay. All right. Kevin's leaving us now because I'm doing Dollar Tree. Well, there's a hockey game starting. <laughs> so, the first two items. <coughs> These two pack chocolate bars. These are for, yes, Country Girl and Andy. These are going in your box. That's if I don't get to them first. <laughs> Tell him to go buy his own. Then, um... I have a project to do this month, the Valentine's project for our Canadian paper crafting swappers. So I had to buy a bunch of Valentine's goodies. So I got these um, bird stickers and these stickers about love and heart stickers and some more fun lovey stickers. And these little fabric bows. And our Dollar Tree, everything's $1.25. Some wooden um, embellishments. I got myself another set of these tools. I have one set and I use them like crazy. So I, just so they didn't break and I didn't have any, I grabbed another one. And I got some of these whack-a-pack fun things <laughs> to, to put as goodies. Some fun Valentine's Day pens. And I found these fun stickers. And a bunch of gems. Purple hearts. Red hearts. Some pearly pink beads. And some pink hearts. Some fun erasers. Some foam stickers like those... Um, candies and more foam hearts larger foam hearts glitter and I'm sure from my other hauls you guys know Dorothy and I use a lot of this double-sided tape so I picked up a few more packages of that then I found these little notebooks and these packs of scented stickers And these fun little maze games. And these ribbons. And then on Friday, we're going to a wedding. So I needed some wrapping paper and bows and a card and some ribbon. So that is our haul. We had a fun day. We're tired now. Anyways. I'm 
back at it. Had a good day. I'm going to have bad days. I get it. But not all of them. So, um, don't forget, I will be putting my P.O. box number in the description box below. I'd love to hear from you all. All right. Have a good night, and we'll see you later.